why planes flying high is efficient. Airplanes are one of the fastest modes of transportation. Around 500,000 people are up in sky at any given moment. Airplanes go from one place to another transporting humans, animals, plants goods including waffles. As the airplane is moving, four forces act on them. Lift, the upward force, drag the downward force by gravity, friction and thrust. By increasing the artificially created forces, lift and thrust, the airplane moves. As the earth is covered by atmosphere, the dense air is seen at the lower levels of atmosphere and light non-dense air are found at higher levels. Modern aircraft are powered by gas turbine engines that pass air through a series of stages where it is compressed, ignited, and expelled. This process creates a high-pressure exhaust that is used to drive rotating engine parts and produce thrust. The cold and less dense air maximizes fuel burn and thus increasing efficiency and cost saving in fuel. The higher airplanes climb, the thinner the air gets, and the more efficiently they can fly because of less resistance in the atmosphere. So larger jets after takeoff would typically want to get to higher altitude as soon as possible. Generally, commercial airlines fly at an altitude of 31,000 feet and 38,000 feet. It is safe for airlines to fly a little higher safely too. Then it may be wondered why they don't fly higher. Some planes do fly higher but generally commercial planes face their own issues with higher altitude. Planes fly depending on atmospheric conditions. Planes flying higher than 38,000 feet may present safety issues during emergency. Additionally, higher the altitude of planes, faster the emergency descent needs to be, which eventually becomes an engineering issue. <laughs>